Oh, if you're blue and you don't know where to go to, why don't you go where fashion sits? Putting on the wrist. Yes, different types wear a dick, or pants with stripes, cats are wicked, or perfect fits. Putting on the wrist. I'm Timothy Everson, a bespoke tailor based in London in Spitalfields, in a Georgian house where we make beautiful bespoke suits. My background is Savile Row. I work with a chap called Tommy Nutter who dressed the Beatles in the Stones many years ago. And I have had my business now for two decades, where we try to bring modern tailoring to a new generation. We're sitting at uh, the desk of John Balby. John Balby was the guy who actually uh, founded Brooks, uh, the factory, and was a serial entrepreneur and a serial patenter. So we also were trying to take that sort of British spirit of, um, of someone who was a pioneer who created wonderful products and how he would probably tackle it today. Um, if we walk over this way here, the first stage that we had to do was work with the prototype. It's very important actually to get the shape and the, the feel of the garment. So all the pocket details, the length and so on, we tried and we had to make amendments. In fact, it was a little bit too short. Not enough movement through um, the back. The pockets were in the wrong position. But even in its own way, it's a rather beautiful uh, piece, almost like an art form. And from this, we actually made a, a garment, which is the garment that is behind us here. It's in a ventile, which is an English fabric or British fabric, which is very sort of synonymous with British uh, tradition, particularly for outdoor use used by people like Hillary and Tenzin for climbing uh, Mount Everest, uh, Sir Malcolm Campbell when he was doing his uh, land speed records, used by the military as well because it has, it's quiet fabric, so it has a stealth quality I suppose uh, when you're cycling. Uh, detail was very, very key on this garment, you know, the way that it would fasten up, strengthen through the shoulders, the angle pockets which are important for when you're cycling to get your hand in. The little D-ring, we like to call it, although it's not really the shape of the D, is inspired from the back of the saddle. And this is basically to have the opportunity to hang things and put them in your pocket. It could be uh, gloves. But we've also got the key fob through here, which is a really nice little detail to put your keys on. Inside the garment, we've got a storm cuff, which fastens like so. And we have reflection on the side and also through the back of the garment. We have a reflective uh, quality. Also, we have the rear pockets, which are in the right position, which are very, very comfortable for actually uh, putting uh, your hands in there and taking anything out that you might want to store. All the fittings and all the uh, trims uh, have all been hand painted in North London uh, with a copper finish, which we think is a very signature uh, detail of, um, of Brooks. The idea behind the garment was actually to have something that you could cycling in, but it's not so cycling specific that you felt that you had to, to keep up with the peloton at the Tour de France. It is something that is fairly democratic, that you could jump on your bicycle, go down to the shops, but feel fairly, fairly cool. The interior is uh, rather beautiful because we like the idea of it being fairly simple on the outside. But inside the garment, it's got some lovely features, such as the straps here, which is a, a traditional thing for hunting um, and shooting. If you get very, very warm, which is an autumn jacket, it's very easy to pop this over your shoulder and carry it uh, on the back. So it's kind of a bit like a, a rucksack, so it's kind of very comfortable. It has a reflective quality and tape. We have pockets on the inside as well here uh, to take modern technology, MP3 player, iPhone, that sort of thing. And we have a feed all the way through to the top so you can put your ear pieces. Um, also at the back here, very simple, Velcro fastening because it's easy, which is double-sided, just to drop down here so it actually cups the seat when you're sitting on a wet saddle. And very subtle things like the labelling here, which will be named and numbered, is very much a traditional Savile Row thing. So each one would be individually named. We've got lovely uh, Fox Brothers, which is a fantastic mill in the west of England. This has uh, got a nanotechnology uh, on the tweed, so it's actually water resistant and sweat resistant, and also a Savile Row sleeve lining, which is really, really beautiful.